Hi, thanks for joining my tutorial today. Have you ever taken a portrait in your studio against a white background and the background just hasn't come out pure white? Well, I've done that and actually I spend a lot of time, or used to at least, spend a lot of time trying to make the background appear pure white when I was doing the photography itself. But I found a really cool piece of software called Vivisa, V-I-V-E-Z-A, from Nick Software, www w.nicksoftware.com that actually saves the day. I can pretty much shoot a portrait against a white background and really just expose for the person and fix in post-production the actual photo itself. So let me show you how I do it. Using Nick Software, the plugin just goes right into Photoshop and it's called Vivisa. I actually use the second version which is Vivisa 2. Uh, so opening up the visa, you see that I have the picture and they have these selective control points. What I do is I merely use the selective control point and I pull the brightness all the way up. So I basically increase the exposure just on the white part. They allow you to duplicate that point and I just drag it down. I do it again so I can drag it down. I'm basically just using these control points to whiten all the areas that should be pure white on the picture and I'm just going all the way around the picture. It takes about seven or eight different um, control points to fix the image. Now you can see his face when I do that is a little bit overexposed so merely what I do is I just add a control point because the other control points are overlapping and I just kind of fix the color on his face. So now you can see what I have is a background that's pure white and he still looks good so if you look at before the background was grayed out and you look at after the backgrounds pure white this piece of software this plugin has really saved the day for me many times so thanks again for joining my tutorial again that's www.nicksoftware.com and the software is called Vivisa 2 thank you